Hello guys, welcome back to The Walking Dead and More. This time uh, I am going to be reacting to a mysterious sketch. <laughs> I don't know what the hell is that. But I just saw a post on Tumblr about a, a ghost story or something like that. That uh, They say that it's really scary. I haven't read it and I'm about to read it. So let's begin. I'm, I think I'm going to put the pictures of it here on the video. I probably will do that so you can read with me. So it says Bong Chung Dong Ghost. <laughs> I don't know what the hell is that. Reading and illustrated by Horang. This story is based on true eyewitness accounts. Okay. It was at Around 11.20 that night, I was dragging myself home exhausting after an entire night study session at school. But there was no one on the street, which I thought was strange. I usually see a lot of people even at night since my apartment complex is pretty big. Okay, I don't have a good feeling about this. Let's move on to the next one. Anyways, feeling scared, I kept looking down on the ground while walking home. Uh -oh. Suddenly, a shadow stretching towards me caught my eyes, although there wasn't anyone around me. Okay, I look it up to see who, who there was, and saw a woman walking in front of me. But she looked a little bit, a little strange. I could say that she looked crippled. She was limping and struggling to walk in front of me, since she was walking very slow. I soon caught up with her. Up close, I was able to see her even better. Okay, I don't like this. She was wearing dirty pink pajamas and looked as if all her joints in her body had been twisted. Worse, her hair was a mess and sticky out of nowhere. Sticking out of nowhere, okay. It seemed so weird that I stopped walking. It, I felt like I shouldn't get any closer to her, nor did I have the guts to pass her by. Oh shit, tu madre! Oh god! Oh god, that scared the hell out of me. <laughs> uh, okay, so when I am scared, I say, "Ah, that was Richie." <laughs> Ah, you know, people say that if you're really surprised, you can't even scream. That was right. I froze there, not being able to move at all. Oh, God. Well, I did a scream. Fuck this. Where is my baby? Oh, God. Please tell me nothing is gonna jump out of me. Okay, my thoughts were racing to her question. Oh, my God. I don't even know what I was thinking when I did that. It gets me chill thinking that moment, okay? Okay, something is gonna come up, I just know this. Okay, let's move. I answered, pointing as far as I could. Over there. I just want her to get away from me. Then she limped and told us what I have pointed to. And I couldn't see her anymore. Oh, she's gonna get back. Oh, I know that she's gonna get back. Oh, God. Fearing that I might run into her again, tried to turn around leave the apartment complex. Could not think of anything but to get to the place where there will be people around. Oh, God. At that moment, she's not here. I heard her screaming for <laughs> Ah! Fuck this. I don't remember anything. <laughs> oh god. From then on, I heard that my neighbor found me pass out on the ground and took me home. Oh god. Oh god. What the fuck is this? In 2007, at a at an apartment complex in Bong Chung Dong, Guan Ak Gu Seoul. A 33-year-old woman jumping off the apartment and dying on the spot. No a surname. Cho, a divorcee, 
Due to her extramarital affairs, she had lost her custody of her two-year-old daughter and decided to commit suicide. Oh my god. After that incident, the show was seen walking around the apartment complex several times. After that incident, Cho was seen walking around the apartment complex complex several times. Fuck this shit. Fuck this shit. Okay, I'm gonna... Oh god. Oh god, okay. So, that was the scariest shit. I'm gonna leave the link in the description below, and if you want to read it, I recommend not to, but if you want to read it, there's a link, and um, yeah. <laughs> It was scary. Uh, thanks for watching and oh god. Okay, leave a comment if you like the story and if you want more of these random blogs. Yeah, and I guess I'll. <laughs> god, I'm I'm really I'm shaking right now. I'm very. It's really easy to scare me. So, uh, yeah. Thanks and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.